All right, welcome back, everyone. So unfortunately, it took us a little bit uh, longer than I was hoping to get back. I had a lot of stuff I had to go do. And so unfortunately, uh, part four is today and not yesterday like I was hoping. But we'll make do. So before we do that homecoming thing, I saw this guy over here. Oh, I thought I had him for a second. The only problem I have with the web wings being mapped triangle is that if you miss something, it just does what it did to me there, where I got all turned around. Hey, come here, car. There we go. Big mistake, spider. You don't do, like, any of the mini-game stuff. Like, it's a really cool way, I guess, to show, like, how much they've advanced. That all it takes now is one button press. But it's kind of weird that now it's like you jump there and they're like, uh, hit square. You hit square and it's done. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, hopefully. Yeah, you're right. Okay, on my way. Yeah, I'm really hoping nobody did a really weird gender reveal thing where it's like, wow, they lit all of Brooklyn Visions on fire with that. Oh man, I can't do this alone. What's the matter, pal? Seems like you might need some spider help. Yeah. I had everything planned out. The clues, the screens, the art, the people, everything has to be perfect. Whoa, 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 okay, I got you. Can you explain a little slower what happened? <sighs> okay. Are you doing math to figure out how to ask someone out? But he's special. I couldn't just do flowers or chocolate. I got some screens and I want to light them up with the message, but the generator's busted. Guy who rented it out to me won't answer. What a scam. I think I can help. Thanks. I rented the generator from Reynolds and Company Rentals. I'll send you the address. On it. Why not just... Can't we just power up the generator with our power? Why not just do that? Why go through all of this trouble? What are we going to go do? Scream at a guy? Generators are going for a lot these days. This baby's ours. Of course. No ordinary rental transaction. Come here. Sweet dreams. Well, that's a big boy. You all right? Oh, there's one more. Oh, hi there. Typical New York that all these people see this and like we're just gonna keep walking, not not pay attention. Thanks, Spider Man. Glad to help. Your client asked me to look into a delivery delay. I guess we got our answer. Yeah, about that. Oh, it was a delivery delay. I thought he said that the one that he delivered was bad. If she's salvageable, it'll take weeks of repairs. Mind delivering the bad news for me? Can do. Better call Vijay and give him the bad news. Tell me some good news. Well, it's news. Generator's busted. Wait. Okay, I'm not out of ideas yet. Just come back. I've got something else in mind. Ah, uh, boy. He's gonna be like, can you put it in webbing? What the? Why the hell are you down Since here now? Now what are you no doing? Good. Does BB have any backup ones? I know they keep generators on the roof, but they're all overpowered for my setup. We'd blow a fuse. Unless you find something underpowered. I should be able to pick up that low voltage frequency. And your electrical powers would fill in the rest. Theoretically. Worth a shot. Or a shot. I've got uh, a friend who would love it. Yeah. 
It is true. Pete would absolutely love that. Found a generator, but it's deactivated. See? That should work great. Mind giving it your special spark? That's not what I have equipped. Now we've just got to route it to the ground floor. Yes! I knew you'd figure it out. Maybe I could connect these towers. Okay. The power seems to be traveling through an old circuit. I can't actually go. I kind of thought it would let me for a second there. All right. Just get up to the damn thing, you jackass. Oh, my God. Yeah. Maybe I should go into electrical engineering. Ah, uh, believe me, I know people that want to do electrical engineering. You don't want to deal with that. Thank you, a million. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, what the, you when did there get to be so many kids down here? Great electric spider. Thanks. I like Spider-Man just fine. Oh, just got a text. He's on his way. Ah, uh, don't go just yet. I can oh, tell you. I am not here for emotional support. God damn it. Ugh. <sighs> Oh, they want me to hit that button instead. Is that the guy? What? A white boy. Uh oh. What are you up to? Um. Wait a sec. That keeps pleasing. He helped me with another first date. Study session. Study date? Spider Man, that's the first clue. Mind flipping it? <laughs> okay. Looks like I'm going this way. <laughs> okay, what is this? Oh, I imagine this guy has to know as well that somehow Spider Man's now involved. Now I'm just tugging things. Uh, yeah, believe me, I'm I'm sitting and waiting excitedly. This whole thing has you written all over it. I've always known you're a special guy, and I'm lucky you're my special guy. I love you, Lucas. Will you, will you? Better fucking work. Uh, God damn it. Uh, not exactly. Oh no. Got to be something I can do to help here. You need to use my chain like me. I was wondering if that would. I'm like, it, it's not letting me move anything. Was close. Yeah, I'm sure the lack of screen would have ruined that relationship forever. Spider-Man! Come down so I can thank you properly! Thank you for making this possible. Hey, we're happy to help. You really got Spider-Man in on this? Best day ever. Spider-Man is here to help love fill the air. Enjoy homecoming. Yeah, we'll see you there. Maybe they'll let me bring the other Spider-Man to Homecoming. Now what? Jesus, there's still more of this? Okay. Okay.
It just looks like there's probably a bunch of Brooklyn uh, Vision missions. So we won't do all of these now. I thought this was like setting up for homecoming or something. So let me we'll switch to Peter. We've done a lot of those already. I wanted to switch over and do some new things. Oh, right. I forgot hey, I put this suit on. Ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, got to grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Uh, I found a prowler thing, and I don't know if I'm allowed to do it or not, so I'm going to find out. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Well, that's Maybe all we can hope for. Job too. All right, no, so you have to be Miles. I figured as much, like, it's nice to know this is here, but I'm like, it wouldn't really make sense if Peter was doing this. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing. One sec. Hey! I'm sorry, friend. My fighter, am I crashing yours? We're crashing right, dude. Turn, turn. Come here. Oh shit, I didn't even realize Miles came here. I noticed the lightning. I'm like, wait, who the hell did that? Excuse me. Did you just try and brand me, you shithead? Wait a minute, I was gonna throw her against a tanker. Do they do the same thing? Why do they keep doing this to us, Miles? Oh, there you are. Sweet. I got to bounce, but I appreciate the assist. All right. But the next post fight piece is on me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Not good. We're both dorks. And who's the guy that was trying to call me earlier? Call again. I was busy the last time. Everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Okay. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Looks uh looks like we found Ooh, another side mission chain. Ooh. Hang on. We can use these. Off the streets it goes. Hello. Uh Jesus guy. Can you put a shirt on maybe? Oh, you wanna go. Starts spouting some nonsense at me. I can tell. There we go. Come on, Spidey. Let's get swinging. Where am I on the map right now? Okay. Chinatown, in which. So this is back to like the map map we know. I'm gonna have to explore this and see how much of it is the same and how much of it changed. Like, I'm curious to know if like Beast Center is still there.
Oh, some area is still in hit with sand here. I didn't know if that would be gone by this point or not. I wonder if that will eventually go away or if there's always going to be sand in this area. Oh, Marco's got a thing here. Don't you worry, Sandman. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to you. And the sandcastle competition Bad starts? Sandman. Now! And no cheating! Get into the water. I opened this for you guys. Oh, there you You just had to make it hard, huh? Ooh, I got stuck there. Oh, hit me. Come on, Sandy. I assume that means we're done. Like other cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. Marco was really laying low these past few years. It would have helped him if I'd known he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my Where are you putting him inside Marco's a vial? Been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. Oh good. I'm glad to know that we're finally making progress with one of our friends. Alright, let's go, Spidey. Alright, I'm here. Over here. Hey Chief. Thanks for coming. We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open. And make sure nobody touches that detonator. Man, Sammy, you really went and left a mess for all of us. Search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud. Oh. Drones are so much better now than they were before. Don't you worry, the drone is coming. Is that a robot? Hey, it's Spider-Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue, so they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider-Man. Thank you. Sandman, stop! Hey, Clark, if you beat you my drone. Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Hello? Stop it. If my drone gets buried in the sand, I'm going to be very mad. Oh, shit. Oh, where are the bad guys? I'm going to hit them with this. Holy. I feel like, I feel like this could be overkill. You didn't even have the strength Thank to beat you. out a little tiny drone like me. There. Help's coming. Fire and rescue knows where you are, and they'll be here soon. You're going to be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Hey Clark, you should be getting a new location any time now. Just came in. We'll head right over once we finish getting Mr. Robleski out. What are those breathing exercises again? Does drone go under here? Oh, drone does go under there. Okay, spider drone is coming. That was a really <laughs> dangerous way to do that, I feel. What if we accidentally hit him? Thank you, Spider-Man. Drop and see him down there. So it's field testing time for my latest upgrade. My insurance better cover this rice. 
Oh. Hey Clark, did you get the last location I sent your way? Heading there now. There's only one other worker left inside. Hurry, Spider-Man. Don't you worry, Spidey's got this. Stop it with that sand, I can't see. Okay, Spidey's coming. Do I get him? Oh. Now the sand isn't coming for you no more. up ahead a few minutes ago. Purple jacket. Make sure you help them. Huh? Hey Clark, I just sent a new location your way. But this guy said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? I'm not missing any help. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'll Come figure on. it out. Nobody here. Uh, stop it. Drone's expensive. Uh, this will take some maneuvering. Damn it. Anything up here for me to... Doesn't look like... I mean, they don't really do collectibles in these sorts of missions, but I was wondering if maybe... There was some reason to go up there. Got a spidey drone. Ah. Go, oh, Spidey drone. Somebody's in trouble. It's up to you to save them. I've fought these people before. Organized and fanatical. They have to be the the big call. What about the intruder that's been stalking around? They can't stop all of us. Now she's looking for supplies. We'll need them. Drone. Uh, How do we get to them? I want my drone to beat them up. the flame i just i just wanted out and you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in painfully let me shoot him with the zapper get out of here mate i don't have time for you cultists right now you know that Yeah, bad prophecy. So, what's my prophecy? Endless fighting, death by building, grow four arms and become a giant man spider? Oh. That's it? Oh, okay. Come here. Everything's going to blow up. Oh, I think I just pulled some people in. What are you talking about over there? Ow. You guys need to stop it. Take care. Would you just drop fire in here? This building's in bad enough shape. Flame burns eternal. 
Yeah, but you're all down. Where are you going? Well, that was really, really powerful. Deserter. Thanks. So what's your deal? Scared you are. Hey! I never did like my smoking. It is Wraith. Lowlifes call me Wraith. Fits pretty well, I think. I tried... Where have you been? No time. Yeah, let's get out of the building. Jesus. Well, they're all alive. They'll thank you, despite the headaches they're all gonna have. I thought she'd just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith, I should keep an eye on her and the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. But I wonder what would have if I would have waited and done that in the black suit. Would he have had a different reaction, or is it mostly all just keeping it the same without much care there? Oops, I did not mean to do that. I meant to. Okay. Let's go to heal the world. And so we'll do this one for a little bit. Sorry, MJ. You've got my full attention now. Go ahead. Yeah, I just needed to change suits. I talked to Gloria, and Beast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stock. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... Without you. Uh, Move on. ...everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. Hey, I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just Keep too Keep your eyes up and off your phone. I'll talk to you later. It's like their version of Alex Jones. That should work for Robbie. Although I guess technically that would be JJ. The Spider-Man aren't the only superheroes in New York. Getting students to class on time? Stop catching everything on fire, you jerks! That was me. Why didn't that hurt you? Burning my webs. Yeah, burn those. Better put out the fires. Yeah, we went from being spider cop to spider firefighter. Stop the fires before they could hurt anyone inside. But that was close. Man, they ruined my new suit. Wait, what happened? All the scratches are gone. When I heal myself, do I heal my suit? There were scratches in this just a second ago, now they're gone. That's fine, I didn't want them there. I'm like, this is my new suit, I just made this thing. I can screw off. Now this is like right in the middle of the city. Emily. 
history. Well, you know, it, was just, it only just hit me now as it was coming in that if the if his mother's name was Emily, I'm like Emily May. Of course, it's after this May and her. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? Well, it's been a while since we got to see Norman. It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Yeah, I will get Norman and Peter. Like Norman definitely likes Peter a lot, even if he disliked Otto. <laughs> and Dad, we'll just uh. Peter hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. Right, Ben. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. It's weird to see Norman in this light. The Happy and not a dickhead. Harry, this place. It'll be nice, I think, in that sense. Because that's like the one thing where I'm like, Norman just kind of hit you as kind of a jackass the whole first game. And I'm like, there wasn't much likable about him. Like, it would be kind of nice if seeing his relationship with Harry makes him a much more likable character in this game to sort of add to the whole, like, man, this sucks that he's the Green Goblin in the next game. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young. Because let's be real, we all know that's where this is going. They absolutely have been setting this up from the beginning, that Goblin's going to be the ultimate, like, final boss of the whole trilogy. My question is, is if they'll make Goblin, like, the main from beginning to end, or if he'll be, like, sort of like what they did with Otto, where somebody else is going to be causing most of the issues, and Goblin's just going to be his own side thing that sort of takes over the final act. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. Uh-oh. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline. Primarily due to a significant predator, a carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Yeah, let's Want give them out? robot laser eyes. Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to protect. Oh my animals. God! <laughs> AKA bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, wait, we're supposed to scare them away, not hurt them? Although I feel like it's because I tried to shoot around it and not at it. See you hiding in the tree. Nice. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to the entomology. Told me to destroy him at the top. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Oh, I'd love to help any way I can. I yeah, let's go take it for a test run against speed. real bee wolves. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Wow, this is like a huge, huge operation. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work. Using protons instead of x-rays with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. This place is awesome. 
I really hope that much like Otto's lab, you just kind of get to walk around here. Dr. Connors. It'll be quick. Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. He's also the lizard. Shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Actually, uh... Busyness, aches, pains... Knowing Connors, he probably really would have liked what Otto was working on, nope. given the whole limb thing. Better. Probably a better, better route to go than the whole uh, nice to see you again. whole lizard thing. It's kind of interesting they go the route here where Peter and Connors don't know each other. I feel like a lot of like Spider-Man iterations have Peter and Connors know each other when he becomes a lizard, so it's kind of fun to see it of like, you know, Peter's already faced the lizard, but. Connors and Peter have never met face to face. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Yeah, let's explore some things. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? Recent That's what I ask myself every day, kiosk. Doesn't one happen to have uh, any insight into the little symbiote thing that Harry's got right now, would it? Hmm. Let's want me to look at some things here. So much to see here. Where do I even start? Wait, these are like the arms and stuff nice. from before. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Oh, hopefully. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Does make you wonder the pull that a certain person hit. Don't you smack. What are you reaching for? You want to fucking fight? What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? I wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Seems like it could have been. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. Not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. Then come back here and get a job, Peter Parker. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. First time exploring. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Controller's really vibrating right now. Is it because of that? I don't know. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom tracer organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing. Yeah, I know he's worried about the Spidey stuff, but he does have to real like he still needs a job. <laughs> It'd be better to try and work with Harry and see if they can make that come together. At least with a friend, his friend might be a little more understanding. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will. 
by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Huh. You couldn't imagine, like, working here and finding out, oh, the co-founder is touring before he figures out if he's going to join as your co-founder. Harry did a lot of work here before coming to get us, is what I'm realizing. Although I'm sure a lot of this was probably Norman. I didn't realize how many people would, like, be working here. I kind of thought it would just be the two of them. I guess it's kind of good they went the other way, because otherwise it would have just been, like, the fucking Peter Otto thing again, just with Harry instead. Yeah, I need to get back to the lobby. There's so much to explore, but I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. a really nice fucking space. <laughs> oh. Come on, we're gonna hear. We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. God, we're about to create the fucking flash. Particle accelerators. Where are we heading now? Has nobody learned? Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Really? Even before high school. Middle school. Middle school. Okay. Oh, that was actually right. You know the Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. Hmm. So calming, and we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll have to check, sure to check it out, then. Out. Yeah, look at all these peasants it's knowing to move out of my way. Got it. Mm -hmm. I am important here. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. This wouldn't happen to be Bill Foster, would it? Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Absolutely. Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal oh God. qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Oh. I get it now. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. Do we do it? We did it. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. 
It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Beautiful work, people. I did it again. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Ooh. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Yeah, well. Foster. So now where? Last stop. It might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on. Where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Was it not on me? See, this shit's nice. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. You need a fucking job, idiot. When I was in treatment... All I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. She joined me. There's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and Nate proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> He's in. Our man is no longer unemployed. Oh. One quick thing. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? It's my boy. But Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> Listen, Peter, you're the boss. Do you know how easy it is to be a boss here? Researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. That's actually pretty good to know. We could always say hey, we're out doing field work when we got to do Spidey before, work. But I was, I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's, it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. 
I almost had a feeling he was about to try and show up. <laughs> Alright, Peter got a new job, and starting next time we'll go follow that lead on the people that took, took our guys. <laughs>